hops, quality local water, malted barley, yeast, and lots of TLC. These are the primary ingredients that comprise the third most consumed beverage in human history, beer. When it comes to environmentally sustainable business practices, it would only be logical that those in the business of providing food and beverage products would be at the forefront of protecting and preserving our natural resources. One of the things that's great about Great Lakes Brewing Company is that they're constantly piloting new environmental technologies and putting them to work in their own business practices. They actually use straw bales in the build out of the new addition to their restaurant in order to insulate that and to save costs on heating. So that's a very environmentally efficient way that one, they're doing what's right, but two, they're saving money on their heating bills. When they have excess grease from their kitchen, they're actually powering the fatty wagon and using that as a way to transport people from Great Lakes Brewing Company to sporting events in downtown Cleveland. And what they're doing with their spent grain is actually making that available to uh, local farmers who then can utilize that grain to produce locally sustainable meats and produce. So Great Lakes is doing the right thing because all of those practices are eliminating their carbon footprint or reducing their carbon footprint, but they're also then being, being put back to work to do things like lower their costs or to provide products that are necessary to help others be economically successful. When it comes to sustainable business practices, the degree to which some go and the true desire for creating a successful yet environmentally responsible company vary greatly. Though some may tout their green or sustainable practices in an effort to be trendy or as a marketing tool more than a heartfelt commitment to keep America beautiful, there are those committed to protecting the environment. From farm to table restaurants to your local craft brewers the entrepreneurs behind these businesses have a tremendous opportunity to engage in sustainable practices that will preserve and even protect our great outdoors. Just brewing itself lends itself to uh, environmental things. Everything's kind of reusable, all the ingredients, the raw ingredients. Um, so breweries for centuries have always reused those in different ways. They're, it's very, uh, I mean, a lot of it's using compost nowadays with urban farms here in Cleveland, which is really cool, I think. Um, most of it goes to a dairy farmer and is mixed with feed for his cattle. Um, so other breweries do, have been doing that as well. It's not something new for us, but it's, it's definitely a starting point for the brewing industry. It makes natural sense to be environmentally friendly because it's just a cyclical thing. We have committees here, our staff forms committees, and they all come up with new ideas constantly about what we can do and how we can do things better. And part of it is because they're all on board with, with what we're trying to do as a company as far as environmental and sustainability. With water comprising 90% of what makes a great tasting beer, keeping America's fresh water sources clean and sustainable is one of the many eco priorities of the folks at Cleveland based Great Lakes Brewing Company. The Burning River Foundation, established as an outgrowth of Great Lakes Brewing Company's annual Burning River Fest, is dedicated to improving, maintaining, and celebrating the vitality of our regional freshwater resources. The vision of the founders of Great Lakes Brewing Company is to establish Northeast Ohio as the recognized environmental leader dedicated to the sustainability of its high quality freshwater resources. In addition to the waterways of Ohio, the brewery was recently part of a collaborative effort to establish a six acre urban farm called Ohio City Farm. Located one mile from Public Square and several hundred yards from the brewery, this just may be the largest urban farm in the nation. Great Lakes Brewing Company's Pint Size Farm in Bath, Ohio provides fresh produce and herbs to the brew pub. We have one fifth of the world's fresh water here in the Great Lakes region. Only 1% of all the water in the world is potable. And of that 1%, we have 20% of that in our own backyard. So. We are environmental stewards, but we're also huge advocates of water conservation and, and keeping uh, high water standards. So every summer we have a Burning River Fest, and where is the more perfect venue for an environmental fest that has to do with water than on the banks of the Cuyahoga River? So we've raised close to $400,000 with our fest that we give back to environmental groups that work on water quality and sustainability. 
When we look at what Great Lakes Brewing Company has done, they are using sustainable practices to change how they do business, and they are using those practices to make them a leader of how other companies in Cleveland move towards a more sustainable economy. Sustainability means a few things for Great Lakes Brewing Company. Number one, if they're conserving resources, they're probably also reducing their costs. So by conserving energy, by producing less waste, by um, streamlining their operations and, and having a lighter footprint on our planet, uh, they're also reducing their costs, which means it's gonna help their business. Um, they're gonna have a better bottom line. The second is that um, customers want sustainability. They want to be able to spend their money in places that support businesses that care about their community, that care about the planet. And so people come to Great Lakes, I think, often because they know about what they're doing to be a greener company. And then thirdly, um, it positions Great Lakes Brewing Company as a leader here. They've been doing this work for a long time, and a lot of people look to their business, the way they engage their employees, the way they engage their customers, and they understand that Great Lakes is a model to follow, both here and around the nation. To learn more about Great Lakes Brewing Company, visit their website at www.greatlakesbrewing.com.